Okay, some Diablo 4 content. Uh, Nightmare Sigil 50. I'm level 80. I didn't get much up. I didn't get nearly any upgrades from level 72. So I was doing same content at 72. And what we're gonna use is a cheap dodge pot because I have dodge and agile passive. In these dungeons, I don't kill much. That's just champs and elites. And I'll share some tips. Always use the trap when you are low age, low energy. That's the key. I'm low energy, use that trap. And I have two unstoppable. Using one to initiate. I'm low energy, use that trap. It resets your poison trap, keep poison trap. Low energy, keep press that trap. And let's see what else I wanna share. For example, I don't wanna kill these guys, but if you put poison trap and if they hit, it gives disobedience stacks. You also want to use basic attacks to proc might and uh, use poison trap to keep your obedience procs up and quicken proc dazes these guys i don't have umbral low energy it resets your poison trap you always want to use your death trap when you are low energy again i don't want to kill all of these guys put poison trap get disobedience Again, I have smiting on the weapon, so it keeps everything crowd control in long way. As you see, I dodge most of the stuff. There is these guys, and move on. I'm playing really slow compared to my zoom zoom play style. Poison trap, disobedience procs. Quicken proc. Again, follow me, poison trap. Keep your po disobedience and might proc with attack. Okay, let's kill these guys. I'm not gonna get shrine, so you have an idea of the build a lot better. Low energy, use that trap. Always save one shadow step, so you can get out pretty bad situations. And this is the elite. You wanna keep him, what is the thing? Uh, Knock down, knock, knock back, dazed, and such. And low energy, that trap. Again, put poison trap. Again, low energy, put that trap. What is the quest? Throw to console. Always kill this herald, dude. Trap. 
and they are gonzo take care of uh, what is the thing on that effects uh, this game only kills you with on that effects by the way most of the time 99 percent of the time follow me give me this obedience props again where to go As you see, I dodge a lot because I have max agile. I'm low on energy. That trap. That trap time. Poison trap as well. So your main goal is keep everything. CC on a rogue I'll kill these guys with a bottom and this is boss room before boss room you swap inner side and you wanna kill the these low energy you wanna focus this guy then this guy low energy the trap and that's it and I was doing it when I was level 72 nothing changed I just activate turf and let's go exploit and let's start with gear what you want to look at here is cooldown reduction total armor life and other extra stuff my chest is not that good i hate this poison uh, red damage reduction for poison enemies but generic damage reduction life and this is really good twisting blades crit chance lucky chance attack speed and you can always see aspects and these Pants, damage reduction, damage reduction from distant enemies. I like distant enemies a lot. Life, dot chance, dot chance, dash. So I don't spend points into dash, and it also reduces cooldown. And twisting blades here, crit multi, wall number damage is what you're looking for first. Rest is bonus. And this cooldown reduction, damage reduction from close enemies, damage reduction, and the malice. If this malice has higher rank or uh, moment speed this would be godly blast trapper here crit chance crit damage wound damage life is four uh, stats you are looking for three is really good again three is really good i don't have umbral revenues aspect solving my energy issues and like i said i don't kill much i just kill elite and champs and if i see big packs i jump on them i don't run around and kill everything so revenues works really well right now accelerating for the attack speed this smooths your gameplay a lot but this is most important but smoothing gives you crowd control the duration increase when you are healthy you are nearly always healthy and you have quickening fog you have double dash to daze them you also daze them with manglers and knock down with poison trap again Ideal playstyle is uh, jump in dash, put your trap, some twisting plates, low energy, use that trap to activate after aftermath, and then you chain CC with that trap and use uh, twist continue twisting plates. Keep puncture for the basic skill damage reduction aspect of the might, and I show you whenever you move on from packs put poison trap so guys gives you disobedience procs and what else let's start with skill tree my skill tree is generic everyone using but i'm max agile i don't use rapid gambits because i have three dodge chance three dodge uh, roll on boots already agile is works really good for me uh, to pair with my uh, nine percent dodge chance and i'm using cheap dodge elixirs dodge from here dodge from here dodge from agile it adds extra 
defense for the build for now i'm experimenting with it and paragon board i'll put in the description but you have to start with combat because you are not level 100 and you will have energy issues a lot so i really suggest starting with combat then you can swap everything around second board exploit other board closer uh, this board is dead ambush this board is cheap shot and you want to get this safeguard especially as soon as possible while is really good devious is really good you want to start with brawler here damage reduction from close enemies and instantly take lawless and armor nodes around it armor is really awesome and turf activate turf as soon as possible then you can get focused havoc i don't plan to go fifth board because i don't think it's point efficient and i don't want to put diminish here exploit there diminish doesn't do much on this board it gives more armor probably and much de some dexterity but you can get armor from what is this this note if you want i guess or somewhere else whatever we're gonna see i mean this is the build this is the this is how you farm uh, 50 sigil i mean you can push till 55 uh, I mean 55 sigil will look same but in 55 sigils on that effects hits way too hard and poison effects hit way too hard I mean you, you probably don't die much but uh, it's not super fun to play at the moment we're gonna see later on I can push 55 53 like no problem but I hate on that effects in this game and I hate poison effects in this game you are constantly poisoned in the map you are constantly running around to dodge on death effects i mean that's it for now thank you for watching maybe we continue later with more rogue videos it's super good class i'm super enjoying it i mean we gotta explore some more paragon board stuff and see you guys